today's video, we are giving you great, cannot miss gift ideas for the men in your life. We're Chris and Megan Rhea from No Small Life here to help you live a life worth celebrating. And today, we're celebrating Christmas, specifically those guys in your life that can be so hard to buy for. The first idea I wanna give you is this JBL speaker, portable Bluetooth speaker for the guy in your life. Now this okay. is something we would probably never get on our own. But if your husband's a golfer or the guy in your life is a golfer, we like to listen to music now when we play on the golf course, you know, having this going in your office or being able to hook up to it in, in different places, bringing it with you to the beach, to the pool, very, It'll very- go anywhere. Yeah. Go anywhere it's with really you. It's really lightweight. It's a great gift. Next is this ratcheting screwdriver. I mean, every man needs this. It's got the Phillips head. It's got the flat head. Mm -hmm. It's got the ability to go forward and backwards. This thing is amazing. Every man would love to have one of these that he can walk around with. Would you like to have one of these? Yes, because I currently do not. This next gift is literally a walking miracle. <laughs> I've been with this man for almost 26 years of our adult life. Um, and for the better part of our marriage, he has used a rubber band as his wallet. That's right. I've tried to buy him really nice leather wallets and he's like, no, they're too thick. I feel them, I don't want it. A rubber band and like a produce rubber band. Like I would yeah. give him the rubber, I'm like, here's, I'm gonna eat the broccoli, here's the rubber band. Yeah, and Not I would wrap my, my cash and cards in that. Yes, you would. Because I classy. hate the bulkiness of a wallet sure. until I got this guy right here. It's called the Code 118 Wallet. And look how cool this is. You hit this little button, all your cards pop up. All of them pop up in order. Then you just push them down, do it again, pick the card you want. It. That's my license, and you put <laughs> it back down. And it also has a little spot for your cash. You can just put it there, and it holds it very nicely. I mean, can you see how thin this is too? Like, it's, it's uber thin. When I tell you it is an absolute miracle this man is not having a rubber band, it's good, it's that good. I love it. Then we come to a kind of like a game-ish kind of a gift for guys. Okay. It's an electronic dartboard. Ooh. Every guy needs this in his office mm. or in his man cave or downstairs yeah. somewhere. So when he's watching the game or having guys over, you can play a little darts, have a little competition, adds a lot of fun to your experience. I like that. I like the idea of putting it in your office too because we all need those little five minute five minute mental breaks, right? Like you get overwhelmed, you get serious. I'm gonna go throw some darts at a wall. It's gonna feel real good and mentally reset. I like that. Next is a good watch. Mm. You like? I do. Good watch. I'm a watch guy. I like watches. I know some guys just want the Apple watch. Mm -hmm. I'm one of those too. Sure. I like wearing the Apple watch. But every once in a while when I dress up, I want to wear a little nicer watch, like yeah. a Fossil or a Timex. So we will link to a couple really good watches below. And if you want it to be extra special, you can do what my wife did, and she did a little engraving on the inside for me mm -hmm. to make it personal. Sent me a little personal message that's between us. Just between us and his rest. Next up is a little fashion piece for your man, but if he's like, oh, I'm not into fashion, or ooh, I'm really into fashion, he's gonna love this. Yes. We're talking about a textured long sleeve t-shirt, okay? And this is not like the long sleeve t-shirt that he got because he ran a marathon. This <laughs> is like a nice um, texture. It's like a cable knit or um, lined, help me out, ribbed. That's what we're talking about. It's fitted, it's warm, but not too warm. It's a good layering piece. It's just, and I mean, it's gonna look great on the guns, <laughs> on the chest. It's gonna look awesome. I personally love these types of shirts. I love to throw them on, go to work. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you don't want to wear a button down right. or get all, you just want to throw something on that looks nice, it's casual, but it's also good for going out yeah. anywhere. You could you could dress it up, dress it down, you could throw on some joggers with it or nice pants, it's a winner. Next is this pocket knife. What? Why? Because every man needs a weapon. He <laughs> needs a weapon in his life. <laughs> if you're gonna get a little knife, this is the perfect one to get because it fits perfectly right in your pocket. It's legal to carry around with you. And I'm sure if this ended up 
in your man's pocket this Christmas, he would like okay, it. Okay, but tell me, why do we need a pocket knife? Because you never know when you're going to need it to open something. Someone always wants to give you, hey, can you open this for it's me? True. Can you get this uh, paper unwrapped? Okay, yes, Does okay. anyone have something sharp? It's just nice to have a utility knife around. That makes sense. Next is this micro trimmer for men. Okay. We need this. Okay, especially when you get into your 30s and 40s, hair begins to grow everywhere you don't want it to grow. Weird places. You might start to lose it where you want it, mm -hmm. but it starts to grow out of your ears, out of your nose, on your chest. It's just... So the main thing, men, we can do as we age is trim ourselves. Groom yourself. Groom it. It's good. Put this on, you get in the nose, you get in the... You get in the ears, it's gonna be great. Every man needs one of these. Yes and amen. Okay, I am just excited to hear Chris explain this next one to you. It's called the beard bib. Yeah, it is. Now, I don't have a beard because when I grow my beard out, it comes in really thick, really dark, and I look like an evil villain. So I tend to not grow my beard. But for those of you who have beards or your man has a beard, the beard bib is amazing because you hook it up to your chest and to the mirror and then you shave your beard. Like this? Like I'm the mirror here? Like it goes like this? Yes. That's how it works. It's amazing. And then the trimmings from your beard fall onto the bib and then you just empty the bib into the garbage. This way you don't get hair in the sink, oh you don't get hair gosh. all over the bathroom floor. Also works if you're like me and you have to shave some chest hair uh, occasionally. Mm -hmm. You can hook the bib lower and then it would just fall right into Oh there. my gosh, this is not just a gift for your husband. This is a gift for you because you're not going to have all those little tiny hairs ever in the sink. And just, your sink won't clog. Just get this for yourself, basically. <laughs> Next, we have rubber silicone wedding rings. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is... Not to replace your wedding ring. As mm -hmm. you see, I'm not wearing mine right now. And the reason I'm not... Because you need a rubber silicone one? That. Yes. And it's because my nice one, when I got married at 21, I was a little thinner than I am now. And it kind of got stuck the other day. <laughs> so I, I've taken it off. And what I need <laughs> is to replace it with like a rubber one that has a little bit of room. And then mm. you can work out and not yeah, hurt your finger. Gym. You could play golf and not hurt your finger. You, if you're working and working with your hands, yeah. you know, it's perfect for these kinds of things. So it's not to replace your wedding ring, but sure. it's an addition to a really nice wedding ring. I love it. This next gift is my go-to stocking stuffer for Chris Rhea for the past 10 years running. And it is a golf club. A golf club. If your man plays golf, listen, we hate spending money on golf gloves. Really? It's a necessity. Yeah. And they're 10 to $20 for a mm -hmm. good golf glove. And we actually hate to spend this money. We'd rather spend it on the golf. So this makes a great gift, but you gotta get the right size. Mm -hmm. And just so you ladies know, if they're right-handed, you wear the glove on the left hand. If you're right left-handed, you wear the glove on the right hand. So make sure you get the right size and the right hand. Have I been getting the wrong hand all these years? No, you do, you've been doing it right. And to go along with that, we have golf balls. It's another thing we hate buying, mm. but is necess necessary, necessity? Necess it's a necessity. And necessary. True. For, to play golf. Now, oh. sorry. No, I something? was just gonna say, I'm, I'm gonna say what you're probably gonna say. So you go right ahead. These golf balls, the ones I'm gonna recommend are the Pro V1. Right. Now, these are the nicest golf balls in golf. So, is that your opinion, or do all golfers love Pro V1s? Almost Pretty much everybody all across the board. is going to agree like the that Cadillac this is the best ball. Golf balls. So, if your guy's good, if he's like a 10 handicap or better, we've got a link to these golf balls because he's going to like them. If he's a little higher handicap, which, which means, means he's, not great. he's not that great of a golfer but enjoys playing, I'm going to link to another group of golf balls that might be better suited for him. Not quite as expensive, but still good. Or an equal opportunity golfing house. I would need like Nerf big giant wiffle ball golf balls. That's yeah. what I need in my stock. Driving range golf balls. <laughs> <laughs> big and foam. 
to stick along with the golf theme, there's a putter green that I've been wanting. Try to get her attention. There's a, on her list. <laughs> there's a putting green I've been wanting. This putting green, what's great about it is you don't just put the ball in the hole, but it actually gets you to take the right putting stroke. And so as you're practicing, it improves your putting. And we're in the Midwest where you can't really play golf in the wintertime. So to have this set up in your office or basement where you can practice putting will help you throughout the year. I'm so thankful we're doing this. He gives me zero ideas until we start filming. So maybe I'll just do like another two or three videos just to get the ideas rolling. Next is a book, The Five Marks of a Man. This is by Brian Tome. Tome? Tome. Not sure how to say it, but it's by him. And what I love about this book is it's practical for guys. You know, with all the questions of, out there about masculinity and what does it mean to be a man, this book gives you a Christian perspective of what it means to really be a man and how to practically apply some principles to your life to thrive as a man in this world Fully recommend it. You know, the next gift got a bad rap for a few years, and I blame friends. I really do. <laughs> they called it immerse. But um, really, we're landing on what? Man bag? Man we're bag. We're going to land on man bag. It's kind of like a briefcase. Mm -hmm. It's leather. It's got, it's manly. Yep. But what I love about this is you can literally put everything in here. Your laptop, mm -hmm. pens, uh, a notebook. You know, I, I don't know about you, but I write things down in a to-do journal mm -hmm. kind of thing, and I bring that with me. So whether you work from home or you gotta have a meeting in the office, yeah. everything you need fits into here. You've had this one for a couple of years, I will say, you guys, and it just, it's one of those leathers that just gets better with age. Um, there are good pockets around here for all like your tech stuff, your earbuds, all that sort of stuff. Chris has used this as a like travel bag, like a, um, yeah. uh, what am I looking for? What's like the thing to take on an airplane? A carry on. Carry on, yeah. thank you. It works beautiful and it looks classy. The leather wears well, he's gonna like it. Yeah. There you go. You do a crossbody messenger bag. I don't know about that, but hey, <laughs> love this bag. And to go with the man bag, <laughs> is this, it's an organizer. Now, if you're anything like me, organization doesn't come completely natural to you, sure. but you want it. Mm -hmm. You want to feel organized. You want to feel like everything is where you can find sure. it. So I found this bag. What I love is it organizes all your electronics. This is the first I'm seeing this. Right. And much like the wallet, this is a walking miracle. This is a walking miracle, but it has all your little extensions for your laptop. It's got chargers in there for your phone, for your laptop. It's got earbuds. It actually has my external hard drive right here, but you can also put a mouse in there or a charger for your laptop. Everything in here, and then you just close it. You put it in your man bag, and then you know every time where all your cords are all the time, all your electronics. So there you have it, gift ideas for him. We gave you a ton of great ideas for the man in your life, the father in your life, yep. the son in your life, the brother in your life, all kinds of good ideas. And as always, everything that we talked about today will be linked below and even a couple little bonuses in there for you guys to check out. And if you're like, hey, what are those cool shirts you guys are wearing? Yeah. Um, so if you're familiar with Christmas Vacation, this says, why is the carpet all wet, Todd? And this says, I don't know, Marlo. <laughs> we will link these below because you need them in your life as well. So have a great day, everyone. And remember, your life is not small. Bye, guys.